Okay, we're going to take some more music now, and to a man whose name you may not instantly recognise, but I guarantee you, you'll know his music. He composed the scores for numerous films, including Titanic, Hear My Song, and Little Voice, countless TV programmes, including Peak Practice, Miss Marple, and Barclay Square. He has over 4,000 television commercials to his credit. As well as all that, he's worked with practically every big name in the world, including Bob Marley, Eric Clapton, Rod Stewart, George Michael, Jimi Hendrix. Oh, and did I mention that he's also an Emmy Award winner? <laughs> You may not know his name, but you've almost certainly heard his music. He composed for the mega-hit Titanic, the Bond film Goldeneye, Little Voice with Michael Caine, and dozens of other feature films. You've worked with Van Morrison, Jimi Hendrix, you've conducted the Royal Philharmonic. Could this, however, be your biggest challenge to date? Everybody involved in the Rockies knew exactly what to do, especially the music, music. And, uh, and uh, we owe a great deal to John Altman, who did some fantastic arrangements. John Altman, thank you very much. 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 Thank you For life is quite absurd, and death's the final word. You must always face the curtain with a bow. Forget about your scene, give the audience a grin. Enjoy it, it's your last chance, chance anyhow. So always look on the bright side of death. I would, for example, get a song from George Michael or whoever that was him playing an acoustic guitar or the artist playing a piano and from that you're building your whole conception of how the record should sound.
and a lot of the great arrangements of great pop songs play those emotional tricks on you to make you feel like you know you, you've, you're actually hearing something that is more sad or is brighter or is is laid back or is pushed ahead. out of ten people to sing Baker Street, what they would sing is that saxophone line, not the actual song. Is it all about the timing? Great performance needs timing, no? Let me break it down. It is variable valve timing. That makes the clear so responsive and fuel efficient. Like when the left hand does and the right does. <laughs> and VVT makes Vava Boom. Hey Bobby, what's the French for Baba Boom?
Hold it. Hold it. One speaker? This movie's in stereo, buddy. Stereo? Should have gone to Radio Rentals. I only bought the video last year. If you'd rented, you could have changed it for the latest stereo video. Okay, guys, let's make it mono. <laughs> Videos you'll be glued to, not stuck with. Fifteen. Yes. Twenty-one. Yes. Thirty-seven. Yes. Twenty-five. Yes. 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 Così fresco e intenso, Vigorson può cambiare il gusto della tua vita. I'm shame and boldness. I'm shameless. I am ashamed. I think if somebody brought me a song that had a lyric and a feel that said, you know, this is wistful and, you know, I've lost you and I want you back, you'd immediately start thinking of oboes and strings. <laughs>
I like to press wildflowers. I'll put on women clothing and hang around in balls. And of drawer. I wish I'd been a girly, just like my dear papa. Hey, Emmy goes to John Altman, RKO 281. This is John Altman's first Emmy nomination and first win. What a treat. Thank you. Uh